What if I told you aliens have already contacted us? Yes, you heard it right. Extraterrestrial beings have dialed up Earth, and guess who picked up? The European Union. Picture this. Our cosmic neighbors reach out, hoping to secure a spot to land, a place to stay, and a chance to share pleasantries. But they're caught in a web of red tape so thick it could trap a black hole. Permits are tossed around like hot potatoes for years, contractors come and go, and politicians, well, they want a piece of the intergalactic pie too. Everything's constantly changing. Goals, standards, even the people pushing the papers. Some of them have kicked the bucket, taking their plans to the grave. And let's not forget the countries threatening to veto the whole shebang, unless they get a little extra something in their coffers. Sure, they're all starstruck by the idea of meeting aliens, but who's ready to foot the bill? So, our friendly aliens are twiddling their thumbs, probably regretting their decision to contact the EU. They've been waiting for a green signal for 26 years and counting. The ETs, they are patient, they understand. They've seen how we humans operate. But how long would you wait if you were them? You see, these extraterrestrial beings, they've mastered the art of patience. They've observed us, studied us. They've even seen the way we, humans, get tangled up in our own red tape. And they're intrigued. Oh yes, they're fascinated by our politics, our bureaucracy, our ability to delay the most monumental of events with endless paperwork and political squabbles. Imagine beings from another galaxy, waiting patiently for a building permit. It's almost comedic, isn't it? The irony of it all. They've traveled light years, crossed the vast expanse of space, only to be held up by terrestrial bureaucracy. So if you're waiting for an alien encounter, don't hold your breath if it's up to the EU. You might see an asteroid hit Earth before that official meeting happens. Now, isn't that a cosmic joke? <laughs>